Billionaire Habits Only buy the best and maximize its life. Have you ever considered the impact of your choices on the environment, your wallet, and your overall quality of life? In this video, we'll explore the art of making mindful purchasing decisions and maximizing the life of the products we buy. By investing in quality and taking proper care of what we own, we can not only save money in the long run, but also reduce waste and contribute to a more sustainable future. Whether you're a seasoned pro or new to the concept of mindful consumption, this video is sure to provide valuable insights on how to make the most of your purchases. The philosophy is simple, only buy the best and make it last a lifetime and beyond. Ever think about how making smart decisions about the things you buy every day can make your life better? It may seem like a small change, but it can have far-reaching consequences. In this video, we will delve into the strategies and practices that can help you make the most out of your purchases, starting with the mindset of buying for the long term. The first step is recognizing the value of quality over quantity. Quality always prevails. From selecting durable products, maintaining them properly, extending their lifespan, and reducing your environmental footprint, we will cover everything you need to know to become a mindful consumer. Remember, it's not just about what you buy, it's about how you buy and how you care for what you have. Making sustainable choices is the key to a brighter future. The more conscious decisions you make, the more impact you have on the world around you. Before starting this journey, let's set our destination. When you decide to buy only the best and maximize its life, you're choosing a path of sustainability and responsible consumerism. It involves having a clear plan, understanding the longevity of your purchases, minimizing waste, and adopting practices that extend the life of your possessions. Here are the 15 guiding pointers to help you on this journey. Guiding pointer one, assessing quality before purchase. In a world inundated with choices, the power to make wise decisions lies in our hands. Before you reach for your wallet, pause for a moment and consider the value of assessing quality before making a purchase. The bitterness of poor quality remains long after the sweetness of low price is forgotten, said a businessman. Think about it. When you invest your hard-earned money in a product, you're not just buying an item, you're buying an experience. You're purchasing something that will become a part of your daily life. It could be that trusty smartphone you rely on for communication, a sturdy pair of shoes that carry you through countless adventures, or even a well-built kitchen appliance that aids your culinary creativity. Let's consider a scenario here. You're in the market for a new laptop. You have two options, one from a reputable brand known for its quality and another from a lesser known manufacturer offering a tempting deal. At first glance, the second option might seem like a steal, but here's where mindful consumption comes into play. By taking the time to research, read reviews, and consider the reputation of the brand, you uncover a different story. The first laptop, though slightly prissier, boasts a solid track record for durability and performance. It comes with a warranty that gives you peace of mind. On the other hand, the second laptop, while cheaper, has a history of performance issues and lacks a warranty. Quality is remembered long after the price is forgotten, mentioned a high-end manufacturer. Now back to the above scenario, ask yourself, which one is the better investment? The answer becomes clear. Assessing quality before purchasing is like planting a seed of satisfaction that will grow into a tree with long-term benefits. In our daily lives, this principle extends beyond electronics to clothing, furniture, kitchenware, and even the food we eat. It's about choosing items that enhance our lives, stand the test of time, and bring us joy. So the next time you shop, don't just consider the price tag. Ask yourself, is this the best quality I can afford? Remember, quality isn't an expense, it's an investment in the long run. Your choices today shape your tomorrow, and mindful consumption paves the way to a brighter, more satisfying future. Guiding pointer two, prioritizing durability. 
Setting durability as a top priority could be the most revolutionary thing you do in a world where disposable items and fast fashion rule the market. It's about shifting our perspective from the short-term thrill of newness to the long-lasting satisfaction of quality. Think about the last time you bought a trendy but flimsy piece of clothing. It seemed like a steal at the time, but after a few washes, it lost its shape, the colors faded, and it ended up in a landfill. Now, imagine investing in a well-crafted jacket. Yes, it might cost more upfront, but it lasts for years, retains its style, and keeps you warm through countless winters. That's the power of prioritizing durability. As consumers, we have the power to change the narrative. Prioritizing durability means making choices that benefit us, our wallets, and the planet. It's a shift towards a more sustainable and responsible way of living. Let's delve into this concept further with a real-life example. A mindful consumer is in the market for a new blender. She could opt for a flashy, cheaper model that promises the world, but often ends up in the appliance graveyard after a few months. Instead, she chooses a high-quality, well-reviewed blender known for its durability. It costs a bit more, but she knows it's an investment in her daily life. Years pass, and that blender becomes a staple in her kitchen. It effortlessly whips up smoothies, soups, curries, and sauces day after day. She never has to think about replacing it because it was designed to endure daily use. In the long run, she not only saves money, but also reduces waste by avoiding the cycle of constantly buying and disposing of cheap appliances. Remember, it's not about what's trendy. It's about what can endure and bring value to your daily life. Consumers have the power to dictate, and the market has to listen to what they have to say. Because they are the market. If consumers demand quality, manufacturers will listen and set their manufacturing guidelines accordingly. If we demand cheap stuff, that's what we will get. Guiding pointer three, regular maintenance. Routine maintenance is the unsung hero of longevity. Lack of periodic maintenance will stop you in your tracks when you least expect it. Imagine this, you're driving a dependable car you've owned for years. It's never let you down, and it's still as smooth as the day you bought it. How did you achieve this automotive nirvana? Regular maintenance. In our fast-paced lives, it's easy to overlook the little things. But these small, regular acts of care can make a world of difference. Just like you visit the doctor for an annual checkup to catch health issues before they become major problems, your possessions deserve the same attention. When was the last time you visited your dentist? Invest in your health. Think of your car as a loyal friend. Regular oil changes, tire rotations, and brake checks aren't just routine. They're insurance against costly breakdowns. And remember that occasional wax and polish, it's not just for show. It's a shield against rust and fading paint, preserving both aesthetics and value. Moving on to wardrobe wisdom. Your clothing is a statement of personal style, but it also tells a story of care. Proper laundering, gentle folding, and occasional mending can extend the life of your favorite garments. It's not just about saving money. It's about preserving the memories woven into each piece. Home sweet home. Your home is your sanctuary, but it also requires some love. Regular inspections and maintenance of plumbing, electrical systems, and appliances can prevent costly repairs down the road. It's not just a chore, it's ensuring your haven remains safe and comfortable. See, it's not about turning your life into a never-ending to-do list. It's about establishing a rhythm that keeps the things you love with you longer. In essence, it's the art of slowing down to speed things up. So the next time you think about procrastinating that oil change, patching up those jeans, or fixing that leaky faucet, remember, it's not just about the task at hand. It's about the enduring value it brings to your life. Maintenance isn't a chore. It's an investment in prolonging the life of your belongings. Guiding pointer four, repurposing and reusing. Out with the old, in with the new is a saying that often guides our decisions when it comes to our possessions. However, 
There's an alternative perspective that's not only eco-friendly, but wallet-friendly too. Instead of hastily discarding items that you no longer need, let's delve into the world of repurposing and reusing, where old items find new life and new purposes. Think about that old wooden ladder gathering dust in your garage. With a fresh coat of paint and some creative vision, it can become a unique bookshelf, adding character to your home while preserving the memories of your adventures. Or perhaps you have a stack of tattered t-shirts in your closet. Instead of tossing them, why not transform them into a colorful quilt, a one-of-a-kind keepsake that wraps you in nostalgia and warmth. In our consumer-driven society, repurposing and reusing might seem like an old notion, but it's a powerful tool for reducing waste. When you donate your gently used items, you're not just decluttering, you're providing resources to those in need. Remember, one person's old can indeed be another person's new. Your child's outgrown toys could bring joy to another family. That old bicycle once tuned up might be a child's ticket to adventure. Repurposing and reusing aren't just about extending the life of objects, it's about creativity and resourcefulness. It's about valuing what you have and finding innovative solutions to meet your needs. It's about making the most of what's already in your possession. So before you toss aside that old chair or that pile of magazines, think about the potential they hold. Adopting the practice of repurposing and reusing can open up a world of opportunities for you that will improve your life and promote a more environmentally friendly and thoughtful way of living. Guiding Pointer 5. Minimizing Waste. Reduce, Reuse, and Recycle. It's a simple mantra with profound implications for our planet and our wallets. In today's fast-paced world, waste reduction is not just a choice, it's a responsibility. Imagine you are at the grocery store, faced with rows of products wrapped in layers of plastic and cardboard. You reach for an item encased in excessive packaging, but then you remember the guiding principle, minimize waste. Instead, you opt for the same product with minimal packaging or choose reusable options. You've just taken a small step towards a sustainable future. Recycling is more than tossing your plastic bottles in the blue bin. It's a conscious effort to give materials a second life. By participating in recycling programs, you help reduce the strain on our landfills and conserve valuable resources. Imagine your daily routine. Your morning coffee is in a reusable mug, not a disposable cup. Your lunch is packed in a lunchbox, not a single-use container. You shop with a reusable bag, reducing the need for countless plastic bags. These seemingly minor changes accumulate into a significant impact over time. Minimizing waste isn't about deprivation, it's about making smarter choices. By choosing products with minimal packaging, you send a powerful message to manufacturers. You demand sustainability and they respond. The shift towards eco-friendly packaging and reduced waste starts with consumers like you. The impact extends beyond your home. It reduces the burden on our overflowing landfills, conserves energy, and lowers greenhouse gas emissions. It's a win for your pocketbook, the environment, and future generations. The smaller your garbage container is, the lesser will be your waste. It's a habit. Try it at home today. So remember the mantra, reduce, reuse, and recycle. It's not just a tagline. It's a way of life that contributes to a cleaner, more sustainable world. By minimizing waste, you're not just making the choice, you're making a difference. Guiding Pointer 6. Energy Efficient Appliances and Lighting Let's shed some light on how your choices can brighten your future while being eco-friendly. When it comes to appliances and lighting, energy efficiency is the name of the game. Imagine this. You switch to Energy Star rated appliances and LED lighting in your home. Over the years, this simple decision translates to significant savings on your utility bills. Plus, it's an eco-conscious choice. How? Well, LED bulbs use up to 80% less energy than traditional incandescent bulbs. Consider this. 
A typical American household spends around $2,000 a year on energy bills. This is only a conservative calculation. By making the switch, you can trim that expense by a substantial margin. Think of what you could do with those extra dollars. Bag it or invest it? But it's not just about the cost savings. By reducing your energy consumption, you're doing your part in reducing carbon emissions. It's like taking a step towards sustainability every time you flick a switch or use an appliance. Make smart and well-informed decisions before making any appliance purchase. Ask questions and do your research before diving in. Purchasing well-made appliances by reputed manufacturers may be worth their weight in gold. So the next time you shop for home upgrades, Remember that energy-efficient choices not only brighten your surroundings, but also the planet's future. It's a win-win scenario, saving you money while making a positive impact. Start your journey towards sustainability today. Guiding Pointer 7. Sustainable Transportation Did you know that the transportation sector is one of the largest contributors to greenhouse gas emissions? In fact, it accounts for nearly 30% of all U.S. greenhouse gas emissions. That's a startling statistic, but the good news is that there are practical steps you can take to make a difference. Consider eco-friendly transportation options like hybrid or electric vehicles, public transit, or carpooling. These choices reduce your carbon footprint and contribute to cleaner air. Imagine this. By driving a hybrid car that gets 50 miles per gallon instead of a gas guzzler that gets 20 miles per gallon, you can reduce your carbon emissions by approximately 2.4 tons annually. That's equivalent to planting about 57 trees each year. Not only does sustainable transportation benefit the environment, but it also puts money back in your pocket. On average, electric vehicle owners save over $700 per year on fuel costs compared to traditional gasoline cars. Carpooling or using public transit can significantly cut your commuting expenses and reduce the wear and tear on your vehicle, not to mention insurance costs, tolls, and parking charges. At times, it may drastically reduce time and give you a chance to network with fellow passengers if you carpool with the same group on a daily basis. So, next time you're thinking about your daily commute, remember that choosing sustainable transportation isn't just about reducing emissions. It's also a smart financial move that benefits both you and the planet. Working remotely from home in your pajamas or working from a beach in India with a coconut drink in hand might be an even better option these days. It will save you a lot more in terms of wardrobe costs, makeup, and lost time. With no need for any sort of transportation, all you may need to do is to get out of bed and start working. Digital nomad culture is the new thing that is catching on. Guiding Pointer 8 long-lasting footwear and clothing. Investing in high-quality footwear and clothing is not just a fashion statement. It's a smart decision that can have a significant impact on your life. Quality fabrics and expert craftsmanship make all the difference, ensuring that your wardrobe staples remain in great condition for years to come. When you choose well-made garments and shoes, you're not just buying clothing you're investing in your own comfort, style, and savings. Here's why. Number one, longevity. High quality materials and meticulous stitching mean your clothing and shoes won't wear out as quickly. You will find yourself replacing them every season. They also make you feel special, warm, cozy, and comfortable with their softness. Number two, style endurance. Classic designs and quality materials often outlast fleeting fashion trends, making your wardrobe timeless. Number 3. Savings in the long run. While the initial cost may be higher, the cost per wear over the lifespan of these items is significantly lower than their cheaper counterparts. Number 4. Environmental impact. Fast fashion contributes to waste and pollution. Choosing quality over quantity is a sustainable choice. For example, let's consider a pair of high-quality leather shoes. They might cost more upfront, say $200, compared to a cheap pair at 
However, if the cheaper pair wears out in a year and needs replacement, you'd spend $200 on five pairs at the same time it takes for the high-quality pair to endure, essentially costing you less in the long term. Moreover, quality clothing and shoes provide comfort and confidence daily. You'll feel the difference when you put on a well-crafted suit or a pair of shoes that perfectly support your feet. So when it comes to your wardrobe, remember, it's not about how much you have, but how well what you have serves you. Invest wisely, and your clothing will not only enhance your style, but also your quality of life. Guiding pointer 9. Repair over replacement. In our fast-paced world, the impulse to replace broken or outdated items is often our first instinct. But here's a guiding principle that not only saves money, but also makes a significant impact on sustainability, repair over replacement. Consider this. In the United States alone, approximately 416,000 cell phones are disposed of every day. That's a staggering number. Choosing to repair that same cell phone when it encounters issues can extend its life significantly. Instead of adding to the growing mountains of electronic waste, you're reducing it. Not to mention the savings you'll enjoy. The average cost of repairing a smartphone is often a fraction of the cost of a new one. Think about it in terms of a broader context. Repairing isn't just about fixing a single item. It's about reducing the demand for new resources, conserving energy, and lessening the environmental impact of manufacturing and disposal. Imagine a world where everyone embraced this guiding principle. It would mean fewer landfills overflowing with discarded possessions, fewer resources depleted to create new items, and a significant reduction in carbon emissions associated with manufacturing. In your daily life, it's simple to put this principle into action. If your favorite pair of shoes has a worn sole, you can have them resold instead of buying a new pair. When your laptop slows down, consider upgrading its components rather than purchasing a brand new one. Repairing your bicycle instead of discarding it reduces waste and keeps it on the road for many more miles. It's not just about saving money, it's about taking responsibility for the things we own and the impact of our choices on the planet. Repairing is a small step we can all take toward a more sustainable and eco-conscious future. So remember, the next time something breaks, pause before you rush to replace it. Ask yourself if it can be repaired. By doing so, you're not just fixing an item, you're contributing to a greener, more sustainable world. Guiding Pointer 10. Responsible Disposal. When it comes to disposing of items, our choices have a profound impact on our environment and our collective future. Let's dive into the importance of responsible disposal. Did you know that globally, we generate over 2 billion tons of municipal solid waste annually? That's like piling up garbage trucks from Earth to the moon and back, more than 8,000 times. Sorry, we have lost count. When you choose to recycle electronics, you're not just preventing hazardous materials from seeping into our soil and water. You're also conserving valuable resources. For instance, recycling 1 million laptops saves enough energy to power 3,500 homes for a year. Donating old but usable items is a win-win. You declutter your space while extending the life of the item for someone else. It's estimated that textile recycling alone prevents 5.7 billion pounds of post-consumer textile waste from entering landfills annually. Now let's talk about hazardous materials. Proper disposal of items like batteries, fluorescent bulbs, medical waste, and chemicals is critical. When any of those end up in landfills, they can contaminate our groundwater. A single car battery, if not disposed of correctly, can leach enough lead to pollute 60,000 gallons of water, supposedly. So, why does responsible disposal matter? It's not just about cleaning up our surroundings, it's about forging a sustainable path. When we reduce waste, we move closer to a circular economy, where materials are reused, remanufactured, and recycled. 
By embracing responsible disposal, we're not just preserving our environment, we're preserving opportunities for future generations. Every responsible choice is a step toward a cleaner, greener, and more sustainable world. Guiding Pointer 11. Water Conservation Water is life, a simple yet profound statement that underscores the importance of water conservation. In our quest to buy the best and maximize its life, let's not overlook the critical role that water plays in our daily lives. Did you know that a single dripping faucet can waste up to 20 gallons of water per day? That's nearly 7,000 gallons in a year, flowing straight down the drain and increasing your water bills. By fixing leaks promptly, you not only save money, but also contribute to preserving this precious resource. Installing water-saving fixtures, such as low-flow toilets and efficient showerheads, can make a significant impact. They can reduce water consumption by up to 50%, saving thousands of gallons annually for the average household. Imagine the ripple effect of such changes. In a year, a family of four can save enough water to fill an Olympic-sized swimming pool by adopting water-saving measures. This not only conserves resources, but also reduces the energy required to treat and distribute water. However, water conservation goes beyond our homes. It extends to our communities and the planet. In many regions, water scarcity is a pressing issue. By being mindful of our water usage, we help alleviate the strain on local water sources and ecosystems. Whether you're collecting rainwater for your garden, fixing that leaky faucet, or simply being conscious of turning off the tap while brushing your teeth, every drop counts. Together, we can ensure that future generations inherit a world where clean, fresh water is abundant. Water conservation is not just about saving money, it's about safeguarding our most vital resource. Let's make every drop count and contribute to a sustainable future. Many say that the next war may be about who gets to control water, a finite resource that all living things need to survive. If we step back and allow nature to heal itself, it will do its thing without any human intervention. Guiding Pointer 12. Sustainable Gardening Imagine a garden that not only flourishes, but also contributes to the well-being of the planet. Incorporating sustainable gardening practices can make a world of difference. Did you know that traditional fertilizers can harm local ecosystems? By using organic fertilizers, you nurture your garden without harming the environment. Conserving water is crucial, especially in dry regions. Consider this. A typical garden hose uses about 10 gallons of water per minute. By investing in a drip irrigation system, you can reduce water usage significantly. Native plants are nature's gift to your garden. They require less water and maintenance compared to exotic species. By planting natives, you create a haven for local wildlife and reduce the need for constant care. So, why does sustainable gardening matter? Well, not only does it save you money in the long run, but it also contributes to a healthier planet. According to recent statistics, sustainable gardens can reduce water consumption by up to 50%. Just imagine, you step into your lush, sustainable garden after a long day. It's not just a garden, it's a sanctuary. The sound of chirping birds and the scent of blooming flowers envelop you. Your sustainable garden isn't just a patch of land. It's a haven for both nature and relaxation. By embracing sustainable gardening, you're not only nurturing your piece of paradise, but also leaving a positive footprint on the planet. It's a win-win for you and Mother Earth. Guiding Pointer 13. Thoughtful Gift Giving When giving gifts, opt for meaningful, quality presents that align with the recipient's values and needs. This simple act of consideration can deepen relationships and promote conscious consumption. Statistics show that over 40% of all gifts given during the holiday season are never used or end up as clutter. This translates to a staggering $13 billion worth of unused items each year. Imagine this scenario. Instead of buying a generic trinket, you choose a high-quality, locally-made, 
eco-friendly gift that resonates with your friend's passion for sustainability. Not only does this gift bring joy, but it also supports local artisans and reduces waste. So the next time you're contemplating a gift, remember that it's not about the price tag, but the thought behind it. Thoughtful gift giving is a small step with a big impact. When giving gifts to anyone, give a gift that will have a purpose and one that is useful to that person. If not, it will collect dust or end up in their garbage can. Select your gift carefully and customize it to that person's interests. Also, select a gift that can keep on giving, such as a book that can be read and then shared. Give gifts from the heart and not as a formality. We have developed a herd mentality when giving gifts to anyone. It should mean something or have a purpose. Just because everyone is giving gifts to someone doesn't mean we need to. Sometimes a hello, a hug, or a kiss may mean a lot more to that person than receiving stuff wrapped in colored paper and tied with a bow. Also, gifts do not come cheap. People tend to look at the price tag first instead of shifting their focus on the genuine nature and purpose of the gift. Guiding Pointer 14 – Minimalist Lifestyle Embracing a minimalist lifestyle can transform not just your living space, but your entire life. Imagine walking into a clutter-free home, where each item you own serves a purpose and brings you joy. Minimalism is not about deprivation, it's about liberation. In fact, studies show that the average American home contains over 300,000 items. Just think about the time spent cleaning, organizing, and maintaining all of those possessions. By decluttering and owning fewer things, you gain time and mental clarity. Minimalism encourages us to focus on what truly matters. It's about quality over quantity. For instance, instead of a closet full of cheap clothes, you can invest in a few high-quality, versatile pieces. Think about it. Owning less means spending less. The money saved can be directed towards experiences, travel, or investments. Over time, this approach not only reduces financial stress, but also helps the environment by curbing overconsumption. Minimalism isn't just a trend, it's a way of life that can lead to greater happiness and fulfillment. Many minimalists put it as the first step in crafting the life you want is to get rid of everything you don't use. So let's declutter our lives one step at a time. By decluttering it will distress us and take the weight off of our shoulders. Less is more. In due course, we'll adapt and learn to improvise with what we have. With less stuff around, our minds will be clear and our wallets full. Also, there are fewer chances of tripping on anything. Guiding Pointer 15, Share and Borrow. Sharing is not just caring, it's a sustainable way of life. Did you know that the average power drill is used for only about 12 to 15 minutes in its entire lifetime? Instead of each of us buying one, imagine if we shared tools, appliances, and resources within our community. If you and your neighbors share lawnmowers, that's fewer lawnmowers produced, fewer resources consumed, and less waste in landfills. It's a win-win for everyone involved. Sharing isn't just about saving money, it's about building a sense of community. When we borrow and lend, we strengthen bonds, create trust, and reduce our carbon footprint. So next time you need something, ask yourself if you can share it. It's a small step towards a greener, more connected world. Share and borrow, it's a sustainable choice that benefits us all. Renting may be the best option. Renting tools or any other item for a one-time use would be wallet-friendly and will leave your house clutter-free. We live in a world where we are all well-connected through devices and various social media platforms, but we are not at all connected on an individual basis. Face-to-face -face conversations, a handshake, a hug, a kiss, the art of handwriting, and other basic communication skills are heading towards extinction. Sharing or borrowing something from someone may be a start from where we could create meaningful and authentic connections, like how it was in the good old days. 
It may also be a conversation starter to a long and fruitful connection that may hopefully blossom and help each and every one of us. By borrowing or sharing items with your neighbors, both of you will receive the benefit of sharing rather than purchasing anything individually. Moreover, you will get to know each other and network with other neighbors as well. Think about it, when was the last time you talked to your neighbor? 5 Baby Billionaire Tips for Mindful Consumption 1. Document your purchases and track their longevity. Keep a record to remind yourself of the value of quality investments. The longer you hold on to them, the more you can maximize its usage. 2. Start small and build a collection of high-quality items over time. It's about the journey, not the destination. The holding time is forever. 3. Educate yourself about sustainable materials and practices. Knowledge empowers you to make informed choices. Do your research before purchasing anything. 4. Embrace the concept of minimalism. Less clutter in your life means more room for what truly matters. Less is more. 5. Share your journey with others. Share, borrow, and connect to create meaningful relationships. Inspire friends and family to join you in the pursuit of a more sustainable and fulfilling lifestyle. In closing, remember that the choices we make as consumers have a profound impact, not only on our own lives, but also on the health of our planet. By prioritizing quality, longevity, and mindful consumption, we can make a difference. Whether it's extending the life of a well-built car, cherishing durable clothing, or sharing resources within our community, each decision we make contributes to a more sustainable and fulfilling future. So let's commit to the idea that by buying the best and maximizing its life, we will not only protect our environment, but also enhance our own well-being. Together, we can create a world where every purchase is a step toward a brighter, more sustainable future. Subscribe with us and learn. If you find the information in this video valuable, please subscribe to watch more videos like this and also share it with family and friends. Write I subscribed in the comment section below and let us know of topics that interest you in the subject of finance. Please hit the like button and the notification bell to be notified. There's more waiting to be learned in our next video. Our aim is to provide you with high quality educational content and information to help you learn and apply what you learn in your life. Hopefully it will benefit you. The contents of this video are for educational and informational purposes only. Thank you for watching.